I remember when I was about 19, I just uh, started at university and I'd left my hall of residence to uh, go out and make a phone call. This was in the days before mobile phones. <laughs> and uh, went across the road and as I went into the phone booth, I heard sirens, um, looked around and uh, didn't think much of it, to be honest, because I was in, in the booth making my phone call. Uh, but then I suddenly heard uh, loud hailers saying, stop what you're doing, come out of the, the phone booth and realized that they were addressing me. I turned around, there was a, a van uh, out of which came about 10 policemen. And they said, you need to stop what you're doing, come over here. Um, uh, they, they said that uh, they thought I committed a crime. And the reason was because uh, the clothes I was wearing fitted the exact description of someone who just committed a robbery. That was the last time I think I wore jean, jeans and t-shirt and trainers for some years. Uh, the situation only got resolved when I walked them back to my hall of residence and proved to them that I in fact uh, did live there. Um, that's one story of a whole number of stories. I've been stopped by the police more times than I can remember. I've been stopped not only when I was younger but even on the way to preach sermons. And all of that means that uh, when I see a policeman today, um, I don't think safety, I tend to think fear. And that's just the result of that experience that I've grown up with. If I were to ask churches up and down the country to consider one question, it would be, why should we celebrate ethnicity according to the teachings of the Bible? I know that sounds really simple, really basic, but it's in my experience a, key, a question that unlocks uh, uh, the fact that we haven't really understood how important this is to the whole Bible story, that from the beginning, um, God chose Abraham so that the families of the whole world would be blessed. Uh, how we haven't realized that um, the first people to pay homage to Jesus, or one of the first people, were wise men from the East how we haven't realized that, that through the Bible story, we're being told that people from every language and nation and tribe are part of God's plan for salvation. And so I think, I think it would be that question, why should we celebrate different ethnicities?